Hey everyone, welcome to FindingWorkAtHomeJobs.com where we're in the business of helping people find home-based work. And today's video is going to be about where you can find work at home opportunities from anywhere in the world. So um, I've, I've heard from a lot of readers and um, even a listener last week who was asking, hey, I, I just, I'm really interested in working from home, but I don't live in the United States. Um, are there any jobs for people like me? And yes, of course there are. So I went about researching. I knew that they had lots of companies that offer this type of work um, based outside of the U.S. I just had to put a list together and I finally um, got my lazy butt going and <laughs> put it together for you. So um, for the person who asked me about nursing work from home, unfortunately, I did not find anything um, uh, in the nursing category of jobs that you can do from home. But there are a whole bunch of other um, companies that hire, so if you're really interested in working from home, maybe you can look at some of these and see if they spark an interest in you. I'm just gonna quickly go through some of the categories. I'm not gonna go through each and every company because you can just come back to this page. I will link this page at the bottom of this video. You can come back and, and kind of just look through at your leisure and click on the links that interest you and apply. So here's my big list of worldwide work at home jobs. Um, let's start with transcription. Transcription is, is you know, pretty easy. You just, you have to build up to the speed and the accuracy and that just comes with time. So I always tell people who are starting out in transcription, don't get discouraged. It comes with time. You just keep doing it. Repetition is what makes you faster and more accurate. So um, here are four companies that hire um, from anywhere in the world, and one of them is QuickTate, there's Babbeltype, Scribby, and Rev. Rev also offers captioning work, which is basically um, when you're watching a movie or a TV show and you see like the, uh, the translations or the captioning at the bottom of the screen telling you what they are saying. You would be, if you worked for Rev, you would be actually writing out what the people are saying. <clears throat> so, um, next category is translation, and obviously that's a biggie for um, countries all around the world. So if you're fluent in English and another language, and you have native fluency in both, then that's um, definitely a skill that you should monetize. Um, I have a link to my page on translator jobs right here that you can click on. If you live in Europe, then <clears throat> I do have a link to a company that hires um, in Europe. <clears throat> Excuse me. So virtual assistants, obviously this one, this is a category that's growing in scope right now because there are so many online entrepreneurs and they need help. And so um, as far as who offers worldwide jobs in this area, you can look at Contemporary VA. Now I did put that the um, pay is usually around $10 per hour, but it can depend on what country you're in. However, this Contemporary VA is only offered in the US and the UK. So, um, but Worldwide 101, like I put here, like the title suggests, this company does hire worldwide. <clears throat> so, um, again, pay may vary. In the US, it's listed around 15 to 20 per hour. It may be different in different countries. So just please be aware of that. Um, it may not be 15 to 20 per hour where you live. It just depends on where you're at. Um, cost, I don't know, cost of living and so forth and so on. So Worldwide101.com jobs, um, Time Etc. Et also hires from the US and the UK and they say that their starting pay is around 11 per hour and then there's uh, Life Bushido and um, I believe they hire worldwide. Online moderation is another biggie, just like virtual assistant work, it's growing in scope um, because social media is so big and the world's becoming a lot smaller and we're all communicating via social media and so they need a lot of online moderators people can kind of keep an eye and keep a hold of things and moderate the chat rooms etc so um, I, I thought I would put my link to a list of online moderators if you're in the US some of them are available outside of the US as well but here are the definite companies that hire outside of the US and they are ICUC Moderation, um, Live World, and Mod Squad. Website testers, now this isn't so much steady work, um, but what they do is they pay you to test out certain pages on websites, just to make sure 
um, and see what the customer experience would be. <clears throat> Usually they pay you about $10 per test. Um, so I do have, again, a page on this topic. You can take a look at it and see how it works. And here are the specific companies that are um, offering this uh, type of work worldwide. That's early bird and user testing. Data entry, <clears throat> I know that you, if you've been uh, reading my blog for a while, you know that data entry is something that I kind of keep an eye on because um, there are a lot of data entry scams out there when it comes to working from home. And um, you just have to be really careful. If you kind of stick with my site though, I'll tell you who's good and, and I won't put a post or a link to the ones who are not good. Click was click worker, excuse me, is pretty good. Um, again, the pay, the pay is very low, but if you work really fast, you can work up to making quite a good amount of money. So here's the link on click worker. It's a whole page, including telling you how to register, which can be a little confusing. Um, so I would suggest clicking on uh, this link, taking you to my page and it'll explain how it all works. Um, Lionbridge is another one. They really do hire worldwide. In fact, I think when you click on their link, I'm just going to click on it just to show you. I think they show you a map, yeah, of like exactly where they're hiring. You can see all the countries that they're hiring here as I um, kind of scroll over their links. So um, just like with Clickworker, their pay can be very low, but they've got a lot of it. So, um, so that's something to look at. Online tutoring. Um, I would happen to think that this is actually rewarding because you're actually helping people. You're, um, I guess in a way, face-to-face -face via FaceTime or however you're going to do it, Skype. Um, and you can really help people out. There are a lot of people who um, just want to uh, learn English. And some of these companies, you have to have like, you know, a degree or certification and some of them don't. Um, italki.com, the student will actually get to choose you. So I might suggest making sure that your profile looks really great. Um, Cambly offers uh, worldwide jobs, but they're specifically looking for English language tutors. And then of course, Nice Talk I talked about last week. Um, this is more con conversational English tutoring. Um, so you don't have to have a certification, you don't have to have a degree, you don't really even have to have experience. You just go on, make sure you do a kick butt video when you're applying, um, have some personality, have some charisma, and they just want people to have conversations with their students in China because uh, you're teaching them conversational English. Okay, and next category, customer service technical support. Obviously another big thing that's greatly in demand right now. Um, and the, the companies, the two companies that I know of that hire worldwide are Zapier and Automatic. And Automatic, I've seen a lot of job leads for them this week, so I think that they're hiring. So if you're interested, I would suggest jumping on that right away. Um, and then of course, there's good old customer service. Um, now, Amazon right now is hiring, but they're specifically looking for bilingual customer service workers. So. You might need to know Spanish or German or Italian in addition to English. And some of these jobs are available worldwide. This specific link will take you to the worldwide jobs that are available on Amazon. Let me just take you over there to see what they got right now. Um, see this one, it's still for the US, but you have to speak German. But there were some that were, if I'm not mistaken, that were available worldwide and I don't see them anymore. Maybe they got taken, I don't know. They were there yesterday, I promise you. Um, oh yeah, here's one, virtual location in Mexico, virtual location in Washington, Virginia, Missouri, uh, Mexico, Mexico, and then US Anywhere, um, US Anywhere, US Anywhere, but you have to speak Japanese. So just keep an eye on this page and then just keep clicking on load more jobs because um, it'll show you, here's one in New Zealand. So, and then here's one in the UK, 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 Arizona in the US, Texas in the US. So there are lots of them. You just got to keep an eye on this specific page because there are a few different Amazon um, work pages, work from home pages, but you're going to want to click on the one that will take you to the worldwide openings. 
Okay, so next is Teletech, and they um, hire customer service reps in the US and UK. You may need to be bilingual, and here's my link. And so last of all, um, uh, I wanted to let you know that as far as two other ideas working from home, a lot of people do um, like Amazon Mechanical Turk or other micro work type jobs. And basically, they're not really jobs. They're just uh, you go in and you work and you just pick up work. So, you know, I would just click on this page because it gives you all the companies that will offer you um, micro tasks. And in fact, here there are seven of them. So you can go through and, you know, like I said, I don't really think you have to be based out of the US. In fact, I know that with Amazon Mechanical Turk, you don't have to be click worker, you don't have to be. Um, and most of these, I don't believe you have to be based in the US. So that's just something to look at. And then freelance sites, there are a lot of people on Upwork that just go on there and offer, you know, what they, what they, um, what their skills are, they'll they'll go on there and offer their skills as virtual assistants, um, proofreaders, accountants, tech support, whatever it is. And I can't find that link on Upwork. I'll have to make sure that it's on this page. But if it's not on this page, I think you know what? I have to update this because I think o Odesk is now Upwork. Yep. So I'll update that um, at some point today. But um, it used to be called Odesk, it's now Upwork, and that's another great opportunity. That's more freelance work though, and you'd have to go out and kind of put yourself out there and tell people what you could do and how much you're looking for, et cetera, et cetera. So that is basically my big list of wor worldwide work at home jobs. And there's a lot here, guys. It may not seem like a lot, but there's a lot here. So take your time and really look through it and like I said, if you're based outside of the US, there's tons of work here. Um, just um, set aside an afternoon to really look through it all and click all the links and see what interests you the most. And if you have any questions, just come to my website and click on the Contact Me tab. It's in the left um, side of the navigation here. Contact me, send me an email. I'll do my best to get back to you as quickly as possible. Thanks, guys. Good luck.